up you guys John here for obese to beast and the topic of today's video is failure not the most exciting topic right <laughs> I want to talk about this day in general and then I want to also talk about just your mindset when you do quote unquote fail right so here I'm doing um, incline press I was trying to go for a 5x5 five five with 170 pounds that's what I was working up to here I'm just warming up with the bar and I hit every single rep I was super excited but the last rep of the last set I end up failing on and you guys will see that in the video but I want to talk about your mindset when you do quote unquote fail because failure really is I, at least I believe in my opinion is something that is in your own head because it's how it's how you react to said failure right um, especially with weightlifting with weight loss as well Failure is something that happens almost every single day at least for myself right when I'm when I'm lifting there's sometimes that I want to get say 12 reps and I'm only able to get 11 but is it smart to let that say 12th rep ruin the or the, the lack thereof that 12th rep really ruin the fact that you got 11 reps like you have to always think think in the positive I, t I tell people this all the time you know it, it's you're gonna be where you let your mind live so if you let your mind live in say the negative that you end up that you end up messing missing a rep right and you're just like you know what no this this whole workout is garbage because i missed that rep or are you gonna be like man i'm really excited that i was able to hit 170 for that many reps because i remember three weeks ago i was only able to hit 165 for that many reps it's all about where you let your mind live and so on this day i mean just to give you some context i had i've been doing 165 on incline for a few weeks and i, I was really excited i really thought that i would be able to get to to 170 on this day and I was really looking forward to it. I mean I was telling Brian and LP that you know what I'm gonna hit this today like they were obviously there kind of watching me and I was really excited so this is set number four and then I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys watch set number five by itself um, just for the raw clip so you guys can get a feel for it I'll see you guys in a second So as you can see, you know, I failed on that rep, but I wasn't going to let that ruin my whole workout or even ruin my day, even ruin a few seconds because I know exactly where my strength is now on the incline press and I couldn't be any happier about that. Now I know I gave it everything that I had on that last rep. And I mean, I can't be more excited about that. And I, I mean, I pushed myself as hard as I possibly could. So how could you feel bad about that, right? And also I wanna, this is my friend Rod, he was wearing a obese to be shirt, so I had to get him doing some some incline dumbbell because I was like, this is too cool, man. So, but yeah, sorry, that was a tangent. But I want you guys to understand that it's really how you handle said failure is how, like your day's gonna go, but that's also how, if you're trying to lose weight, if you mess up on a day, if you eat too much, if you if you eat something that you weren't supposed to on your diet or how it, whatever it is, are you gonna let that ruin your whole day? Like, cause that's something I struggle with still is, I eat something, I go over on my macros, and then so I'm like, you know what, I'm just gonna eat whatever. But th does that really make any sense, you know? Like, just because you go over a little bit, that doesn't mean you have to ruin even more work by just going and binging like insanely crazy. And I know that this, some, what I'm saying is a lot easier said than done, right? Because like I said, it's still something that I struggle with daily is, if I go over on calories, then I end up just going crazy or it's with any failure it's how you react to it and I just I mean I, I know I keep saying the same things over and over again but I, I just want you guys to understand that 
and I want to show you guys that I mean I'm not perfect nobody is perfect nobody on Instagram that you see that looks great all the time it seems like right they're not perfect they're messing up on their diet as well nobody on YouTube that you think is always killing it hitting PRs I guarantee they have bad days in the gym it's not about how successful you are when you're doing great it's about how you can pull yourself back up when you do mess up so that's really I mean that's all I really wanted to talk about I, I appreciate you guys sticking around for the whole video if you are still here thank you guys so much you guys are amazing make sure you like comment and subscribe there was one other thing that I wanted to say oh yeah, yeah. look how buff I am <laughs>